One of the best ways to grow your skill set as a software developer and improve your resume is to work on personal projects. These projects don't have to be large scale or complex, they just have to show potential employers that you're passionate about programming and do it in your free time. If you're a beginner, something like a Wordle spinoff might be a great introductory project to get the ball rolling. The good news is, most of the work is done for you. Thanks to Chase Wackerfuss's open source clone using React, TypeScript, and Tailwind, you can get started on your version of Wordle with a completely finished template. This is a great chance to dive into React and get familiar with TypeScript, a programming language that is gaining popularity quickly. Now this project is ridiculously easy to set up. Firstly, clone the project, then run npm install, and then run npm run start, and your application is running and you're good to go. Now you can explore the app, learn how it works, change the styling, tweak the gameplay, and modify it to fit your unique version of the game. My version is simple, it's Wordle but for software developers, devdl, and it looks like today's word is units, how fun. Others have created a version for airport codes, animals, the office, movie titles, and so much more. You can check them all out in the repos or readme. Once you have your version finalized, you can even host it for free through Netlify, a service that builds and deploys your websites without any hassle. All you need to do is connect it with your Git provider, add in your couple environment variables, and your website is up and running. For more details, check out my walkthrough of hosting with Netlify. Alright, I hope you found this video useful and it inspires you to create your own little Wordle game. It's super easy and a fun little project to get you started with React and TypeScript. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video.